What's up junkies? Today we're going to be showing you guys how to install the Bull Gear box mag kit into the ANK249 box mag. To get started, we're going to gut this guy by taking out these two bottom screws, taking off the side plate and the screw on the feeder block. And then on the Bull Gear kit, you're going to want to take out these three screws up here, one here, and the one that's underneath uh, this feed blocker. All right, so once you get to this point where everything's taken down, we're gonna store all these components from the original ANK box mag properly, as we don't need them for the time being. Oh my leg! Oh. And we're gonna get to modifying our box mag to work with the a with the bull gear top. To start off, we're gonna punch this pin out, and that'll release the feed tab or the tab for the box mag. And then we are going to cut off a couple sections on this box mag. To start, we're gonna cut off basically these two blocks on both sides of the top of the box mag. As well, it's going to come all the way down to be flush with the bottom of the box mag. So we're gonna take all of this material off. And we're gonna do that to both sides. So once you've got your box mag cut and you've got these two little squares removed, make sure you don't go too far so that you have a nice bit of wall here. This side was a little bit thin, but that's gonna be all right once we get it placed on. So then we're gonna take our bull gear adapter piece and set that right on the top of the box mag like that. And then we will, with a drill or Sharpie, mark out this hole, this hole, the main hole here, and then we will want to mark out the width of this little rectangular cutout as we will need to add a cutout onto the box mag itself. All right guys, so once you have your holes drilled out and your slot cut, we're going to take our bull gear insert, and slide that on in. Make sure you tuck in your wires for this next part as they'll have to clear this. And once they're on the other side, we can pull those back out. And then we'll take something like a flathead to wedge our box mag away from our bull gear insert so that this feed tube can make it under. Like that. And just go all the way in until it kind of pops in. There you go. And then we'll just reassemble the top of the bull gear adapter as previously shown. Um, if you are using the bull gear method, you will want to put all three of these pins um, in the adapter. If you are just using the Junkies TCU, go ahead and tuck this red one back into the box mag and just use the black and green ones. Like so. All right guys, and after that, you've got everything all installed and you are good to go. From here, if you're using a Airsoft Junkies TCU, you'll wanna solder just the green and black connector up to a JST connector and hook that up to your TCU. And that'll slip into your gun and right onto the top of your box mag. 
Just in case, uh, if you guys are having any technical problems, you hook up your bolt gearbox mag and absolutely nothing happens when you pull the trigger, make sure that you guys actually set the power switch to on and turn it up a little bit or it will not wind initially. Aside from that guys, we're gonna hook this up to a gun and see how it feeds.